Ever since I was a kid, I just love solving the problem. I found out I can solve math's problem in class very quickly. The more complicated the problems, the more satisfying for me to solve. When I told my parents I want to pursue a career in math, they told me math is not for a girl. My parents want me to study law. And just like other Chinese kids, I follow my parents' guidance. I got my degree in law, but I don't really like the career in law. I want something different, something uh, related to math. So I came to U.S. and enrolled in the actual science program at the University of Iowa. I got my master's degree in actual science, then my ASA credential. After graduation, I joined the Principal Financial Group. During that time, I became an FSA and was promoted to an actual officer. It was a big step in my career. My last few years there, I oversaw the actual functions of Principal International in Mexico and in Brazil. The international work was fast-paced and challenging. I wanted to take my career to the next level, but my boss told me I did not have management potential. I disagree. So when I saw an opportunity in China, I took the risk. The insurance industry in China was still young and in need of experienced actuaries. I joined Taikang Life as chief actuary at the executive level. After that, I took on an even bigger challenge. I joined Ping An Life, the second largest life insurer in China. I was the chief actuary there. After one and a half years, I moved to Ping An Group, where I became deputy chief actuary. Hi, Candy. I reshaped the actual functions for Ping An Group, focusing on capital solvency, actual risk control, and research. Right now, about 70% of the function performed by the Ping An Group actual team were created under my supervision. As a result, Ping An Group has the best actual functions in the market, and I'm proud of it. For the past four years, I work on international regulatory level with IIS. I propose solutions on key issues impacting Ping An and China insurance industry as a whole. The FSA is one of the reasons I could get the chief actuary role in China and also work with the IAIS. It's recognized and well respected globally. The FSA has been a valuable credential throughout my career. It has opened up many opportunities for me, both in U.S. and China. And now SOA is adding predictive analytics to its curriculum, which is very relevant in China. Big data is a way of life in today's business environment in China. So that will open the door for more actually to work in predictive analytics. SOA is like a home for me, especially while I was in China. After being away from my family for some time, I was ready to come back to the U.S. I continue to be a curious person with a passion for learning new things. I'm always looking for my next adventure. My name is Ling Ling Wang, and I'm a proud fellow of the Society of Actuaries.